The state with its uh, beauty, let's say natural, cultural and heritage elements. This uh, Ranutsav 2024 focuses mainly on improving the overall experience of the tourists. In 2023-24, uh, Ranutsav, there was a total of 7.42 lakh visitors coming there. And also, a focus will be on uh, women empowerment. The state with its uh, beauty, let's say natural, cultural and heritage elements, it has its uniqueness to offer. Therefore, given the government's focus, knowing that tourism is a sector that can actually provide employment opportunities to those regions, you know, where there may not be much of uh, other uh, means of getting livelihood, so this is a very good intervention. Therefore, the government has adopted the whole of government approach, not only for tourism department, it has pooled in all resources, all departments. So uh, given the footfall that we have seen recently, it's a very encouraging trend. We hope that Gujarat, not only in India, will eventually make it to the world stage as a preferred tourist destination. This uh, Ranutsav 2024 focuses mainly on improving the overall experience of the tourists. Uh, see, it had come a long way since 2005. So this time we would like to ensure that the place has proper uh, internal mobility plan so that, you know, uh, for the visitors of uh, the tent city as well as those who are coming to see only the white run, they have a seamless experience. So we have tied up with GSRTC for this. And also, it is not, you know, just that we want people to come and uh, just see the white run and then go away. We would like them to spend as much time as possible in and around Kutch, density and, you know, otherwise, since it has a very rich, you know, uh, offering. Therefore, we have identified many locations in, uh, to which we can take the tourists. So this also would you know, add to the experience of the uh, tourists. So uh, when it started out in 2005, it was a two day long event, and now it is a 100 day long festival. And uh, the area at that time was known for migration. Now we see more and more locals taking part as you know, a part of the festival. And uh, you can see uh, in 2023-24, uh, Ranutsav, there was a total of 7.42 lakh visitors coming there. So that would have you know, translated into lots of employment opportunities, uh, direct or indirect, for example, as a tourist guide, as someone who's providing them accommodation, you know, maybe someone who is uh, providing them transportation. So, so many ways that the locals would have you know, benefited out of this event. And from uh, being something that needed uh, viability gap funding from the government, it is as on today now a revenue surplus event. So during this uh, run itself, every weekday in the evening, there will be cultural performances by the local artists and during weekends, there will be, uh, you know, performances by uh, noted artists across, let's say, at the national level or something. So that is how uh, the local artists will get a platform as well as, uh, you know, this handicraft is a big thing in uh, Kutch. So to showcase the rich heritage of Kutch, uh, craft stalls have been, you know, made a part of this uh, Ran Utsav where local artisans will have a platform to showcase their work. And also a focus will be on uh, women empowerment. Uh, we will tie up with uh, Gujarat Livelihood Promotion uh, Company Limited and the local self-help groups, uh, you know, women will be given uh, craft stalls there so that they can also be a part of this uh, initiative. And also, uh, we would like to make this uh, 
event more immersive you know experience therefore we would be sending people who visit you know run out of the tent city to let's say the uh, craft villages so that they can interact with the master craftsmen and all so that will help not only in you know uh, showcasing and also it will promote what the rich you know heritage of kutch is not only to the visitors but to by through word of mouth to the other people uh, who will after hearing this is from their friends would like to come and visit kutch